Hi, this is Mrs. Knopf, and today we are going to continue working in our new method book on the trumpet with line 17 down by the station. So this tune is working with the same three notes that we've been working on, C, which is open, and it's one ledger line below the staff, and then D, which hangs from the first line, is first and third with that third vowel slide kicked out if you can do that. And then the E, which is on the first line, that's first and second valve. So let's go through line 17. Let's see what we have and let's look for patterns. So the trumpet reads the treble clef and that's what we have very first thing at the beginning of the staff. Then we have our time signature. We have four beats in every measure and the whole note gets four beats. So let's break down those note values. If we have a whole note, that gets four beats. Half of a whole note is a half note. Half of four is two. So those half notes get two beats. And then half of a half note is a quarter note. Half of two is one. So the quarter notes, which are the notes that are colored in, those get one beat each. We're going to start each note with a t sound. And we're going to sustain the air and let the tongue just interrupt. T just like that. So at the very beginning in measure one, we have a half note C, and then we have a quarter note C before we move on to D, which is first and third. In the next measure, we have two half note E's, first and second valve. After that, we move on to a D, go on down to a C, back to the D, up to an E, and then in measure four, we skip down to two half note C's. Now I hope you've noticed that lines one and two are almost identical. As a matter of fact, the only difference between the two lines would be measure four is two half note C's and measure eight is a single whole note C. So we're gonna go at the very beginning. We're gonna play through this very slowly and hopefully you'll be able to keep up and play along. Make sure you're starting each note with a t and lots of air support. Here we go. One, two, ready. <laughs> That's it for line 17. That's how you play down by the station on the trumpet. If you're having trouble with any part of it, don't be afraid to work on just a small piece of it at a time. For example, if measure three is giving you trouble, then just do a couple of notes. Start with the D, go to the C, and just work those two notes back and forth. Well, that takes care of most of the third measure because it's D, C, D, and then we end on the E in that measure. So sometimes it doesn't take long to just isolate one thing that gives you a little bit of trouble and then it becomes a lot easier. I hope this helps and we'll see you next time.